My name is Chris Lund, and my partner, uh, his name was uh, Charlie Ray. Uh, so we've always kind of, you know, c cycled back to the Arctic, um, and this trip was specifically to encounter Porcupine Caribou Herd, and uh, another project that I wanted to do was uh, photographing the Arctic loons, Pacific loons, and red-throated loons. Looking for something I ain't found. You know I'm looking over here now, looking underground. Well, show me your face. I never know, and I'm leaving here today. Peace down the road, and I'm. You know I'm too far gone. Well, I. You know I'm too far gone. With the pressure brought on by drilling and how fast the Arctic is changing and global warming, you know, we thought we would go there and see for ourselves. You know, I'm too far gone. You know, I'm too far gone. In the Arctic, you don't have fencing and you don't have a lot of roadways. You don't have a lot of infrastructure blocking animal movement. So we have, you know, the caribou. I, I guess I would like I would like full protection for the Arctic refuge. Uh, they have a huge area called the Petroleum Reserve, which is west of the refuge and it's a massive area and it continues on you know for hundreds of miles and it sweeps all the way down down to the coast it's like isn't that enough yes i'm older than you where you come from where you going to take care when you leave The Arctic is special because it's so extreme that it, it harbors a list of species that has adapted uniquely to its environments. And, and these species, they aren't found anywhere else. They're not found in the temperate zones. They're not found in the forests of, you know, pines far south towards Fairbanks or Anchorage. Um, so I think that, that you go to the Arctic and you, you, you spend time there and experience it. You're gonna see animals like the polar bear, like the uh, different loon species, and they're just so highly adapted for that, for that environment. It just doesn't make any sense to me to uh, you know, move what's in Prudhoe, the petroleum reserve, over to uh, an Arctic or to the uh, to the to the wildlife refuge and start to exploit the oil there. I'm giving up letting you take the wind while well, you nearly bash my face right into somewhere I've never been. It's the last place in North America what where we have a mass migration of herbivores, large mammals. That's, that's left on this continent. 